Get Bounty Lennox. Oh, wait, no, never mind. I liked the idea of the second game, but it, it really did lose, like, some of the first game's charm. I want to see the Narcacola. Yeah, but Narcacola is straight up, uh, contraband. Another day, another dollar. If I get the cops on me, I'm bonered. We're almost done with this utter shit bucket, bucket of a truck. That'll be nice. I'm looking forward to that. Go for that guy. Oh, no, stop. Down. What do we got? Nothing but jackrabbits? Plus side is jackrabbits go down in a hurry. I was trying to grab Richter, but I guess not. Let's see. What difficulty is Wander playing on? Isn't there like an auto align, auto track button? This is the easiest difficulty. Which has the auto align and auto track. Which is just right click. Works pretty well. Ooh, alien fossils. Looks like that's safely in the hold. That sounds kind of fun. The last one, more steel. Anything else around here? Doesn't look like it. Okay, alien fossils might be a nice windfall. Okay, so what do we got? Show force? Well, oh, I? Oh, right. Detected valuable. Sure thing. Looks like it's mostly just all steel. I'll take what I can get. Okay. So we're going for local delivery? Actually, local delivery is perfect timing, too. Docking request received. Okay. So we've dropped off a decent amount, or we're going to drop off a decent amount of stuff. Uh, concourse. What are we doing on money? I really wish I could trade up ships. I might be able to, but still. Okay, so we got several diamonds. No, no, we don't have any diamonds. The alien fossils are nice. Steel, not so much, though. Yeah, we did take some damage there. A bunch of jackrabbits are still dangerous. Not the most dangerous, but dangerous. Okay, landing pad, launch. Oh, we're almost there. It's like 10,000 more and we can replace our ship with something considerably faster. For better or worse. Here we go. Pirate danger, pirate danger. This ain't gonna go well for you. Destination reached. Okay, so Starting by raising shields. But oh, that's a coach whip. Shoot. Missile inbound. Missile inbound. Missile inbound. Missile inbound. Missile inbound. 
shields down. That's another coach whip. Oh shit, we got two coach whips? Last one. Okay. So you're taking some hits. These freaking coach whips, man. They're no trifle. I had a lock. He keeps telling me it's like they require a lock. Only lock from a rear profile, and it's like. Mission complete. Don't tell me about that. Ow. That hurt. I mean, we survived. We'll get paid a little bit extra, but still. Game doesn't come out until next year. I mean, if you're willing to buy a game on X, the game on Epic, it comes out much sooner than that. No way we're going to the next location. But yeah, it comes out next week on Epic. Comes out a year from now on Steam. On... Uh, a year from now on Steam. And I think it's coming out on other platforms as well. Let's see. Is there a storyline in this game? There is! Uh, but... It's hard? So I've just been doing side quests to get myself through. Wow, the surface damage looks really nice. Uh, but yeah, if you want to pick it up on like Switch or Xbox, I believe it'll be coming out on them too. Yeah, hopefully it'll come out on Switch. I've apparently it will be. Some somebody dropped by to say that earlier, which like that's kind of cool. Soy paste. Family sells for a bit. Uh, let's see. Nope. Unobtainium ore. That actually isn't bad. Nothing can go wrong with the distress signal. Everything can go wrong with distress signals. They're evil. Oh. Did I forget to repair? Chicken fried home style armadillo. What the hell? Anyway, new ship? Not quite. We got uh we got five thousand to go before we get the good stuff. But I gotta repair my stuff. Yeah, so once console versions are completed in the final approval process before they can go on sale. Be circling around uh to the PC version for the promised mod kit. Ooh! That'll be fun. But no, I don't know. I'm curious how the mod kit's gonna work with Epic, considering, as far as I know, that they they don't have much for like proper mod support, which is unfortunate. I guess that'd be a good time to put it on Steam then. Let's see. Do we do show of force? I keep trying to do this quest. I keep not doing it. Engaged by distress signal. Uh, <laughs> I don't trust him. But considering we just saved, we might as well do it. So does your old ship trade in any value? Don't think so. It's kind of a hunk of junk. Let's see. So, question. Alright, how about consoles? PS4 and Switch are on the way. 
Just gotta complete them, polish them, rate them, and certify them. Cool. I feel kind of bad for Xbox, but I don't know. I've always felt like Microsoft should actually just like go full in on the PC market. And then just sell Xbox as like a... Let's see. What am I looking for in here? Okay, let's slow down considerably. So it's actually this thing. Anti-matter spec. Okay, so that hurt a bit, but we came out of that with a fair bit of contraband. Yeah, no Xbox? We're considering it, but it'd be better after PC and other console versions. Keep checking back. I... I really would like to see the, uh... Let's see, I, I would really like to see the... sales data for what platforms actually do best. Just what I needed. A gaggle of shitheads. Destination reached. Because, like, from my perspective, Switch and, like, I predominantly play games on my PC, followed by my Switch, followed by my PS4. I haven't touched my Xbox in years, nor have I ever had the need to, which is kind of frustrating, but that's largely just because... Every Xbox-related game usually launch, launches on Steam or PS4 as well. It's very rare that it's rare to see any Xbox exclusives at all. And it seems like they, they're going to be supporting uh, PC more than anything else on top of it. That it? That was fast. Where's the... where's the planet? There it is. Let's actually land while we're here. Maybe if Iron Rain for the Switch would be awesome. I did mention that when I was talking to them, but they weren't even sure if they wanted to put it out on, uh, PC. But then again, they put EDF5 on PC. Hopefully that did well for them. God, I hope so. Okay, commodities. Oh, those antimatter specs are worth a bunch. The soy paste, actually. Okay, so what are you going to do when you upgrade to a ship with an actual turn radius? Not a goddamn clue. Well, I'm in the market for some new wings. I don't know, though. This might be out of my price range. You know quality when you see it. Fast, maneuverable, and mean. The Sandhawk is an absolute bargain, and perfect for the Merc on a budget. What do you say? Are you ready to take the plunge? Yeah, why not? Fantastic. Let me just get you the keys and complete the paperwork, and we'll get you settled in. I guarantee you won't regret this decision. Oh god, I love that new ship smell. So, it looks like I can actually trade the Platypus in. Like, I can trade the Sandhawk in for full value. That's really nice. Okay, so... Repairs needed. Defense. So we've... We've got the Veristeel, still. Uh, so it looks like all of my equipment carries over, which is amazing. So obviously, don't have enough for that. If I'm not mistaken, I've got four weapon hard points. And a launcher. So, I've got a I've got combat lasers. We could buy stuff like tracers 
Or they even uh, start picking up the Gauss gun. It's great distances. So the question is, what do we want to do? Because I could pick up the tracers. Uh, I could almost pick up two tracers. Because we could pick up two mass drivers. Or just go all in on combat lasers. Okay, so this does not give me a whole lot of time. Uh with full linked fire with all four, but I think that'll be okay. Okay, so mission board, available missions, cargo run, detective work, pirate siege. Right, we should probably also save up for a, uh, a, a jump drive, because we actually don't have one yet. Okay, so let's, let's take this sucker out for a spin. I love the fact that they all have their own uh, liftoff animations. Huh. I love this song. This is by far my favorite. The UI is completely different too. Well, that worked out. Gotcha. Bonk. Well, I didn't help. I mean, I helped. I killed one of the guys, then rammed another one. I love the fact that the UI is completely different. All right. Ooh. This is different. Anyway, so yeah, now I've got an uh, UI. Well, I am officially dangerous. Okay, show of force. Okay, let's do this. Destination reached. Well, I gotta say the ships feel good. This thing might actually have too much handling. I kind of like fighting against the stick, and this thing's just like, you want to turn left? Woohoo, boy, we can do that. But that's okay. We... So easy now. All right, uh, let's see. So we want to go probably back here. Because it's time for me to... It's time for me to save up. we got to get that jump drive so we can actually get out of here and go to other systems. We've been bumming around here for far too long. Oh, it feels so much better to be in a good ship that is not just a bucket. And nice part is we can actually even switch over to... Uh, let's see. Yeah, don't forget some loot. Peace. Concourse. I guess that'd be the other thing to look into. We could actually get, uh, let's see, components, a cargo hold. I 
me get the cargo extender for now. It'll let me carry, carry a little bit more. And I should be able to trade it up for the uh, cargo extender too. Maybe? I'm not necessarily sure if this ship can... Yeah, okay. It does not support. That's fine. I just figured I'd pick that up now. Okay. Uh, let's see. So we want to go... We don't want to visit the bar. We want to go to the Merc Guild and we want to start picking up some goodies. I'm not actually that much tougher, but it should be fine. So... Objective gunship. Show of force. The rest of these are out of system. At some point I'll join the Merchants Guild. Let's see how much it costs to join. I'm looking to join up to the Merchants Guild. Can you give me the song and dance? You've come to the right place, ma'am. This is indeed the local chapter of the Merchants Guild. We broker lucrative trade opportunities, pairing respectable businesses with enterprising individuals. You can join our ranks for only 1,000 credits. Interested? Well, that's... that's yeah, nothing. I think I'll go ahead and sign up. Excellent. I'll execute the fund transfer, and you can avail yourself of our job matching system right away. I'm sure you'll be satisfied with your decision. Okay. So let's check missions from these. Uh, let's see, simple cargo run, local source, soy paste. So it looks like a lot of cargo runs and like sor sourcing missions. Yeah, I don't care. Oh, well, that's fine. Thank you, Laharl, the main character, for, for the sub and welcome. I don't know if you're excited for Disgaea 4's, like, HD remaster. I guess it was already kind of HD, but I'm excited for that. I haven't played a Disgaea game in ages. That'd be a good excuse. Personally, I'd still prefer if they made a Disgaea 6, but that'll happen at some point later, maybe. Okay, do we want to... Major threat might be an issue. No, no jump drive. Well, do we try it anyway? Screw it, let's try it anyway. Okay, so objective gunship, show of force, major threat, and a pirate danger. Should be fine. I really hope there's some, like, really wild ships at the end of this game. Like, I don't know. Like a sentient amoeba that you just kind of hang out in, in, like, inside and it just, like, gloms onto ships. That'd be really hard to program, but it would be cool. Okay, show of force. Yeah, we can do that, as long as we don't bonk. Actually, seeing as we're here... Let's see. It was Pirate Danger that was the hard one, yeah? Let's do Pirate Danger first. Autopilot disengaged by distress signal. Uh, eh. Destination reached. So, I seem to be in a bit of trouble. I sure oh, could use your help. I love these. Never mind. Believe this ain't gonna go as well as you think. Hostile craft oh, entering the area. Well, it's fine. I was gonna say I love these, but then it turns out to be an ambush. Well, we'll see what I can do. I mean, my my, look what we have here. Let's go after this guy real quick. You're dead, girl. Missile inbound. Okay, let's go put a little bit more into shields. Whoa! What happened? Oh god. Why did that happen? Wow. Okay, so through some kind of arcane combination of buttons. 
I, that's not what I pressed. Like we're gonna just blitz away for a second. Okay. I'm not even sure. Is I think he died? I'm not sure. Okay, through some arcane combination of buttons, I seem to have been able to... Uh... Oh. Am I not locked on to anybody? There we go. Let's see. Arcane combination of buttons. I managed to completely, uh... Reset my audio settings for this game. Which made it incredibly loud for reasons. Here's the question. Can we murder that? Ah, shit. I was supposedly going at total neutral. Didn't seem to... Oh. Wait, what? No! God damn it! I'm trying to kill the engines and it's just like... Bat. Okay. That'll turn it down. It better, better be one hell of a bounty on this sucker. you can like blast out the engines on this sucker. Actually, I think you can. Oh, I guess I'm just gonna slam mode down his shields for a bit. It's trying to come about. Whoops. Supposedly, you can press uh, Q and E to change your speed, but it doesn't look like you can actually hold it down. No, oh, stop. Lord, the UI is kind of weird. Oh. If you do right-click, you go into pursuit mode, and that's how you speed back up. that's the case. Fortunately, it's going to take some time to hurt this guy. I'm trying to figure out exactly where their turrets are. Unfortunately, their turrets are just kind of wherever. Ow, ow, ow. It's gonna take a little, a little bit of time. Yeah, what I should get is some dumb fire missiles or something, potentially for just like pure blast combos. Where's that turret? Focus the turret. Just 
far enough away that I'm not going to really hit him. I might have to straight up give up on this guy. Unfortunately, you can't pinpoint target shields. Or not shields. I, like, I was really hoping I could blast the turrets off this sucker. Because it would certainly make my life easier if I could. Target subsystems. I can I? Okay, nope, he's got he's got bottom shields. Cause yeah, if there was an option to target subsystems, I would. But it like I guess we have one other option here. It's not at all the button I'm pressing. Let's see, get it at extreme range and match speed. Unfortunately, I do not have the, uh... I don't have the setup for that. But it looks like I've done some serious damage to this guy. Standard distribution, thank you. So far, so good. But yeah, might be worth picking up uh, some Gauss weapons at some point. God, I really wish I could target subsystems specifically. There might be an option for that. Let's double check the uh, key mapping. Because yeah, we've got ECM, pitch up, auto track target. Cycle MFD secondary context. Lock target. I haven't tried that yet. You're to the Sphinx, as it's Out of Colorado. Roll up. Are you grubbing kidding me? This better have dropped some serious cargo. It probably did. Question. Uh, 
Okay. So the entire point of this thing is... Now I have these that I can blast through. That pirate is not worth killing. The cargo it was carrying might have been. It dropped steel. Steel. Yeah, this pirate was super trash. It straight up dropped steel, steel, soy paste, and steel. Uh, I mean, now that I now I know I can fight one of those things, but like, holy shit, that was not worth it. Now, some places where a load of steel can sell for a thousand, it's true. But like, still kind of sucks. 